How's it going lads? Marshall here and welcome to another review. My good god, does it feel good to say that? Yesterday I do apologise, there was no video. Similarly, I've been snowed under. I'm actually moving place at this moment in time. There's going to be a setup tour, there's going to be a QA and a for 100k, there's going to be all sorts lads and I'm in the process of doing that. So once again, apologies for no video yesterday but today we have a big player, it's not Bill, it's not Messi, it's freaking Pele, Graziano, the Italian Pele. Guys, if you do want any cheap MSP, PSN, head over to g2a.com, use that code M89, get yourself a discount, every single link you'll need, right there in the description below. Now his price range is quite cheap, 9.9 to 70k on the Xbox and the PlayStation, so he is affordable by everyone on this game. 89 position and sensational 90 reactions 95 strength that is where it stops with these mental and physical tributes 55 acceleration and 57 sprint speed skill attributes 82 ball control sensational look at the dribbling 69 you can say what you want about that but that is terrible 86 finishing 99 heading accuracy in the air this guy is very good very accurate and he does win the majority of the headers given that he is six foot four tall now it didn't actually score any headers with this guy even though he was good in the air his finishing was a letdown even though it's quite high honestly when he did get in the area got into these kind of positions the goalkeepers are pulling off miracle saves whether that may be not playing on fifa for a couple of days and i've been off my kind of cool but honestly graziano pelle his finishing wasn't Pele-esque. Honestly, it wasn't great. Hence why I've got shooting as a pro and not finishing. Shooting-wise, he generates a lot of power, a lot of curve at times. Honestly, he's got a crack and strike from range and close in. A very, very powerful strike and his strength. Not only does the power come with his shooting, the power comes in the how this guy plays. He's very strong, 90-something strength or 89 strength, I'm not too sure, but it was very high. Honestly, in game, you do feel that he is very strong and he can shield off your opponents from time to time. Hidden-wise, in the air, like I said, he is very good, but his finishing just wasn't there. He didn't have this killer instinct, which with this card, I thought he would have had. Like you seen hit the post there, a guilt edge chance. And like you're going to see from the rest of the clips, guilt edge chances, but he's not putting them in the back of the net. His finishing is good stat-wise. In-game, it wasn't great. Hence why I did say his finishing isn't a pro and shooting is because his shooting is generally quite good. Now the cons. There are a lot of cons with this card because of how one-dimensional he is. Pace, he isn't fast. If you think this guy's fast, there's something fucked up in your head because he is very slow. Acceleration in the 50s, sprint speed in the 50s. 57 pace. Terrible absolutely terrible he does everything very very slowly and all in all he is very slow on this game driven wise he just he's like a robot he's like this bloody robot that hasn't been oiled he's so damn stiff it's ridiculous and it's just not good it really isn't good and his skills two star that's terrible he is very one-dimensional because of that and his dribbling and his pace he's very one-dimensional is this card so overall as you will get a rate of a 6.4 and a value of coins of a 6.6 .6. if you wonder where bill is where messi is they will be coming very very soon lads i hope you have enjoyed this review if you have smashed the hell out of that thumbs up button subscribe if you are new around here and as always lads i will catch you all next time